All right, let's do theorem 45. I think I lost my previous lesson, however. Let's do it over again. This is theorem 45. The diagonals of an isosceles trapezoid are equal. So we just talked about what a, an isosceles trapezoid is. It's a trapezoid, which means that the sides, the bases are parallel. Exactly one set of bases are parallel. And we know if it's an isosceles trapezoid, then we know that the sides are equal. And we just learned that the base angles are also equal. <clears throat> so what we want to do on this one is show that, and I'm just going to talk through this proof. We're going to show that the diagonals, so I'm going to draw in the diagonals. Here's the diagonal. And here's the diagonal. We want to prove that the two diagonals are equal. So if we take, what we're going to do is we're going to prove that this, this red triangle Oops, that was really bad. With this red triangle is congruent to let's just get the Christmas colors to the green triangle. Let's just this green triangle. If we can prove that these two triangles are congruent, then we know that they're the side of their triangles are congruent. And then they're the diagonal, so that we would prove they're equal. This is a fairly easy proof. You can see we have a triangle right here. We can say that um, the sides are equal. So we ha already have this side is equal to this side. So this, this one in the green triangle is equal to this one in the red one. They share this common side right here. This side is in the red triangle, and this side is in the green triangle. So those are equal. And we also have this angle in each of them because we know that isosceles trapezoids with their base angles are equal. So if you flip this green one over on top of the red, these two angles line up. So these two triangles are congruent. The green one's congruent to the red one by side angle side, and therefore their parts, this diagonal, is equal to this diagonal, and so the the diagonals on my isosceles trapezoid are equal. I'm going to do one problem from your homework. I'll do that in a different video if you would like to watch it. It's, it's uh, number 34 in this lesson. So that's it for the lesson. You can watch the proof if you want to see how to do a proof with this lesson.